Yes. Oh, it's a random. Is he urinating in the background? What is this? Hello, everybody. Grace still plays, and we're back with a brand new game Healer's Quest. Now, this game is like super alpha, not even kickstarted type of deal. The only thing that's out right now is a demo, but. I have played a little bit of the demo, and this game is hilarious. Now, just from the look at it, it looks like a fairly innocuous little RPG game, right? Oh, how wrong you are. Let's go ahead and start right into this, and you'll kind of understand exactly how this game goes. Now, I already have a little game started. We're going to go with a new game. Which sentence correspond be the best to your play style? You don't like to be challenged and stop playing games which are too hard. You like to be fairly challenged and don't mind retrying some levels a few times. You enjoy hardcore challenges. Hardest games are the better. Now you'll notice some clear kind of English issues going on here. Um, I think that the creators of the game are Portuguese or Spanish. I'm not 100% sure. Let's go with the middle one though. Normal mode, LOL. I knew you wouldn't select the hardest difficulty. Well, thanks. I, I don't know what that was, a goblin or something. I'm not really that sure. So first, let's create a good looking character. <laughs> All right. So we have a couple of options here to wear the Occidental RPG robe. Oh, Japanese RPG belts and robe. The casual healer, no way. All right, so it looks like you're just wearing your tidy whiteies there. Let's go with the casual healer. I like the nice denim jacket he has. A hairstyle, huh? Long, short, monk, long. Never seen this one before. Let's go with short. Uh, hair color, uh, we have all kinds of colors here. Uh, and they're all strange. There's not like a brown or anything. Uh, whatever, we'll go with, we'll go with, let's see. Oh, oh, hey, there we are. Uh, yeah, he'll have pink hair because why not? For a beard, we have small beard, complete beard, huge beard, goatee, darky style. That seems kind of odd, an odd way to describe <laughs> that. Or none, we'll go with none. Nose, default, big or small. Uh, yeah, sure, I have a pretty big nose, so we'll give this guy a big nose as well. Healer classical hat with the giant red cross. You know that you're gonna get the heels from this poor schlep. Strange hat, okay, basically that's a Smurf hat. Hat suck, <laughs> don't forget your scarf. A healer's bandana, or the classical healer's hat. Let's go with the bandana so that we can actually see our hair. Uh, for <laughs> The healer's cross, a minus, a star, divided, what? Let's go with the minus. That's pretty funny. Oh, you can have different colors for that, too. Uh, well, my favorite color is green, so we'll go ahead and give him a minus green symbol as a healer. I don't know why, but why not? And for his wand, we have a couple of choices here. Stylish, classical, or minimalist. Girls won't be able to resist him. Ooh, that's what we're going with. And for the skin color, we have anywhere from I don't go into the sun at all to I'm black. So let's go right about, I'm kind of an olive skin guy, so we'll go right about here. That looks good, bam. Now let's find a fitting name for him. So the one that we're given is Jimmy. The last character is Y. <laughs> so we have to have a Y in our name. Uh, le uh, uh, we'll name him Plebby. Plebby the Pleb. There we go, Plebby the Healer. Karma, good. Backline allies have a plus one bonus defense when their health is low. <laughs> Evil, offensive buff spells are more effective, but defensive buff spells are less effective. And then there's a couple of other things here that you can do um, to choose kind of like what this karma power is. I think we're just gonna go with victim. You think you can speak to animals, but you can't. Y your friends, Made you believe this by hiding behind a tree and making animal voices one day. Don't tell anyone. This is our little secret. What? <laughs> Daddy's son. Plebby starts the game with 400 gold. 
Feeling secure. As long as the odds, as long as the odds are you will win the fight, your natural mana regeneration speed is increased by 5%. Ooh. Agoraphobic. You feel under pressure when there are a lot of people around you. Healing spells are 5% more effective when there is only one ally. Ooh, that sounds really bad. Uh, okay, this victim thing is hilarious. Let's go with feeling secure. I don't know what our little secret is. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, let's go with feeling secure. Lucky me, this magical wand gives me awesome powers. All right, now let me tell you guys real quick what the point of this game is. So this is a lot like your typical kind of find encounters and fight game only you're a healer obviously that's all you get to be your buddies get all the loot and equipment to increase their abilities and your job is to heal these people but the problem is, is that not everyone gets healed the same the game will kind of teach us that in a little bit and this game has a real weird sense of humor this game is so cool i love the i love this kind of like weird almost like a watercolor design as well but I should avoid letting people know, or they'll try to steal it from me, <laughs> being the victim I am. Uh, hello, Tanky. Excellent name for our fellow full plate wielding buddy companion here. Is that you, Plebby? What are you holding in your hand? This? Oh, it's just a random magical wand, but it seems like it can only heal people. What crap? <laughs> I mean, amazing! So you can heal me, right? What are you waiting for? A kick in the butt? Hold the plus, or hold the left click on the knight and hold it to heal him. There we are. No problem. You got it. Don't stop. Bam. This is your wand's heat gauge. When it's high, your spell is less effective. Okay, so basically we have like a JRPG overdrive meter here. That's interesting. Got it. Wow. What's this magical effect around your feet? Impressive, huh? The blue circle shows that my special ability is activated. Oh, yes. When I have more than 85% life, my already powerful attacks will be even more damaging. So don't forget to keep me in shape, okay? Fight. Let's do this. Yes. Oh, it's a random... Is he urinating in the background? What is this? Oh my god, <laughs> you're out of mana. This guy, this is like the guard is coming up to this guy lecturing him. You will recover mana slowly as time passes. All right, just kind of regain a little bit. Give him a few heals there. Yeah, victory. Did you see my new powers? Yeah, not too bad. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to go. Hey, wait, I'm coming with you. Run, plebby. Bam, 10 gold, and we're level two. We also learned Meditate, which doubles our mana regeneration speed. All right. Ooh, some bandits. Hang on, Grumpy, I'll help you. <laughs> Grumpy? Yep, I'm a barbarian. It, this looks like one of the guys from, uh, from uh, Castle, uh, what the hell is it called? Clash of Clans. To tell, you, to tell the truth, he's a lumberjack. Oh, your feet are doing blue magic too. I guess this is your special ability, right? It's called Berserker's Rage. It makes me deal huge damage when I'm less than 30% life. Yes, but don't let me die or I'll kick your butt. Oh boy. All right, so let's get this guy healed up so he has his special ability. There we are, a little bit more for him. Keep him above. Oh, what the hell was that? Was that a failed attack? I don't even know, it sounded like a like a wet fart. I don't even want to know. This thing, he's still chasing the guy that urinated on the wall around in the background. Okay, Grumpy, let's find Darky. <laughs> I don't know if that's okay or racist. D Darky? <laughs> a little bit more gold. Oh, we got a, a golden ring. And we also learned stone skin has damage received for a few seconds. Let, what is this? What the hell does this ring do? All right, now you'll notice this adventure is so frightening. Look at how sad and and forlorn this poor bastard looks. Now, you can equip different things for these people. Now, notice you can't equip jack crap for your guy here. <laughs> you can equip... I can't equip weapons. I already have my magical wand. I hope the others won't get mad at me. Now, we can equip things for this guy. This golden ring 
The owner gains 50% additional gold. Well, that sounds good. So let's go ahead and equip that on Grumpy, if I remember his name. Can't you give me anything better than this crap? <laughs> Magic is for wimps. Oh, God. If you click on them, they say different things. Give me the best items or I'll kick your butt. I, we'll spend all day clicking on all this. This must be Darky. I guess this is the black magic user. Look who's here. Are you going to ask me again to join your crappy team, Tanky? You bet. We found a secret dungeon full of treasures. You should come with us. A dungeon? But it could be dangerous. When you say dungeon, do you mean that there could be real monsters in it? Or, oh, really? Can I have my share of the treasure? Uh, I would like some treasure, guys. We will discuss this topic later. First, we need Darky to come with us. I won't. As for some reason, as for the reason, it's the same as always. You don't have a girl in your team. Wow! What a jerk! You're lucky this isn't tabletop D&D, man. They're harder to find than than a shooting star. There may there are gorgeous girls in just about every RPG. So find one, and I may change my mind. Thanks, Dick. Ooh, hey, look, an elf. I'm not an elf. I'm an archer, stupid. Oh, did you see that? You have blue magic around your feet, too. It's my special ability, survival instinct. But it triggers only when the odds are against my team. When the odds are, my team will lose the fight. Well, that sucks. The red arrow on the bottom of the screen points toward the winning team. Got it. That won't happen. We'll help you get rid of these rats. Fight. All right. Let's see. We've got a few different things here. Oh, crap, our guy just went down as I was scrolling through the different abilities. Let's go ahead and heal our barbarian, or not our barbarian, our barbarian guy is on the ground dying horribly. All right, let's meditate a little bit, gain a couple of extra manas. Now, it looks like our archer isn't really taking any damage at all. Another stone skin for you, my good man. Oh, I don't have any more mana. Meditate it is. Oh, no. I feel so bad, Grumpy. You poor bastard. Have no fear, m'lady. Those beasts are gone. M m'lady? I'm a man. <laughs> My name is Count Rupert von Lietenstein. Yes. Too, too long didn't read. He'll do the job anyway, says Grumpy from his back. Sleeping on the job. Are you, Grumpy? Yeah, from now on, your name is Beauty. What? Come on, Grumpy. No time for BS. Get your ass up. Oh, they don't get any... They don't get any experience when they die. That's terrible. We have to make sure that this guy stays alive. Ooh, regenerates 10 HP per second during 7 seconds for regenerate. And what does this anti-rat ring do? Let's see. You don't have a ring yet. Let's see what this does. Owner has plus 4 defense when there are rats nearby. Okay. Let's go ahead and give that one over here to Tanky. Actually, you know what? Let's change the rings. Let's give him the golden ring because he has a better chance of staying alive. And let's give him the anti-rat ring because he has a better chance of getting his ass whipped while I try and look around at the different things in this game. Oh, hello there, gorgeous. What the? <laughs> Come on, take it easy, dude. With that large hood, he might as well be blind. Okay, I'm in. Let's get that treasure. Hey, you. You hurt our brothers and now you'll pay. Oh, look at this guy. Looks like a classic, I don't know, Final Fantasy character? When using the heal spell, you will sometimes see a very big star coming out of your wand. Oh, you're right. When this big star reaches the ally and disappears, disappears, left click on him. Precise timing is crucial. This will give you a heal boost and decrease the heat gauge. Ooh. Try it now on the night before the fight begins. All right. So did that, did that, did it work? I don't know, I think it did. Click here to skip. Oh, Jesus. All right. Stone skin on you. Oh, wow. The healing is starting to get kind of intense here. Go ahead and put a regenerate on you. Oh, 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 oh. Don't you die there, buddy. There we go. Out of, we're out of mana. We're going to go ahead and meditate here to gain some. There we are. Out of mana. All right. Looks like we did okay. Everyone got their asses a little bit kicked, but hey, we won in the end. And that was a pretty tough fight, actually. Ooh, we got an emerald amulet. Let's see what it does. Let's see here. 
let's go to... I guess it's also considered a ring? What would it be considered? Ah, here we go. A gentleman's amulet. Minus 10 damage against women? This is terrible! <laughs> Why would you wear this? Reduces casting time by 25%. This is obviously what we want him to be wearing. Why do I even have to carry this? Oh, no. I mean, that's very nice that he's a gentleman at all. But for the purposes of the game, arg. Plus two max damage when all other allies are dead. And beauty is alone with plebe on the battlefield. That is a worst case scenario. This game is just blowing my mind. So what's the plan now? The king asked us to kill a dragon in classical dungeon it's a few miles away to the south classical dungeon playing such sultry hits as kenny g south can't you give precise indications such as left and right don't worry we can only go south anyway seriously what a crap game come on this is just a kickstarter demo the final game will be a the final game will be a goddamn open world Ooh, you said it not the developer all right so basically, the developer gets a free pass if they don't manage to do it. And what about our rewards? Gold and glory will be our rewards. But I already have plenty of gold and glory. He meant gold, glory, and women. Okay, I'm in. Oh, you misogynistic bastard. Can I come with you? Sorry, Plebby. You can't deal damage. You'll just be a burden. Welcome to my problem that I have in every game that I play. I usually end up being the healer because none of my buddies ever wants to do it, and I realize what a necessity is, and everyone's like, oh, the healer, he messed up again, or oh, the healer, lowest DPS. You know what? The healer keeps your asses alive, but I can heal you guys. Really? I didn't notice. Thanks, asshole. Let him come. He'll be useful somehow. Sure, we can eat him if we run out of food. <laughs> oh my god! Ah, whoa, hey, what the hell is this? Oh, it's a tutorial. Welcome to the skill forest. Do you need a quick tutorial? Yes or LOL, no. Well, kind of, yeah, I do. This is the heal spell skill tree. Read it from top to bottom. I ain't got time for that BS. Click any spell on top of the screen to see that spells that spell skill tree. All right, oh, so here you go. Strength has a spell tree and regenerate and all those if you have enough magic stars you can upgrade a spell by clicking on the highlighted upgrade icon so can i upgrade this and this is how many stars will be spent to learn a new upgrade for the spell okay we don't have any stars got it that's it have fun well thanks for the info i don't have any stars to use so i feel like a jerk all right so this is the this is the the tutorial I guess we can get to it by pressing s that's interesting um, so to move it looks like we do the up and down key let's go and see what's in this strange forest down the pathway oh a treasure chest yes yes treasure oh there's gonna be Phoenix Downs and such in it Wow treasure can someone explain what a chest is doing right in the middle of the forest Listen, Darky, okay, this is the staple of every RPG ever made. Just deal with it and open the damn chest. I don't care. Let's open it. Oh, my God, man down. Tanky, no. Well done, genius. The chest exploded, and I'm pretty sure it is empty. Well, not completely. There's a scroll in it. Maybe it's a treasure map or a new spell for me. Whatever it is, it's mine. Let's see. Damn it. It's just a stupid message. What does it say? LOL noobs the trolls oh I see what you did there the trolls troll successful but their actual trolls will make them pay for this son of a bitch there's really nothing here come on oh man I just got owned I got owned by the game developer oh what the hell was that oh oh here we go uh oh, it looks like a random encounter. Well, thank you for describing in breaking the fourth wall for us all. Random encounter. Would you show us a little bit more respect? This is a carefully planned ambush. Yeah, do you know how long we've been hiding here waiting for you to pass by? Do you really think it was fun to play match three games on our cell phones to kill time? Do you? Don't give them too many details, pig smell. What a horrible name. Could we please proceed with the fight, gentlemen? We have a dungeon to reach before nightfall. Fight! Let's do this, boys! Go ahead and cast a regenerate on him. 
Ooh, looks like uh, Beanie over here, or whatever the hell his name is, is getting his ass kicked. There we go, a little bit more healing for him. A little bit of meditation being done. There we go, a little bit healing for her. Ooh, we're out of mana. We gotta regenerate big time. All right, there we go. A little bit extras. Oh no, man down! Oh God, yes! Holy crap, I'm the worst healer ever. Everyone's dead except for Darky, and Darky gets all the experience. You learn strength, double the allies damage. Well, that's nice. Oh, I'm the highest level person in the entire party. Oh, we found a tactical sword too. I guess that's better than an intactical sword. I don't know. What is this? We've got the rat slayer, which does plus one damage when there are rats nearby, or the tactical sword. As long as another ally has his special ability activated. Well, let's do that. That sounds pretty good. Sounds like something we might use. Anyway, guys, we're going to go ahead and end the episode for now. This is so weird. I'm, this game is so funny, though. It's actually pretty tough, too. The concept behind the healing is, like, very micromanageable. Micromanagerial. There we go. That's more like it. So let me know in the comments, guys, what you think about this game. I think it's hilarious. I, I would love to keep playing this. Just let me know. Until the next time, guys, stay foxy and much love.